What is up guys, my name is Frost, and in this video I want to be talking about stage destruction in Naruto Storm 4. Now I know with all the new features that we have seen in Storm 4, such as the new counter attack system, elemental damage, and we have seen the new support system that can pretty much extend the combos. So what I really want to be talking about is the stage destruction that was promised to us a while ago in the first Storm 4 reveal after the Madara and Hashirama battle when CC2 had announced that stage destruction would be a new addition to the game. So when I mean stage destruction, I mean stage destruction that isn't limited to just one stage and that it is available within all stages of the map. And when I mean not limited, in Dragon Ball Xenoverse, this is an example for you guys, in Dragon Ball Xenoverse, there was only stage destruction in a few select maps such as the Cell games, the city, and I believe that was it as far as Namek goes on um, with certain houses. So I want the stage destruction to be available within all maps. So now I'm going to explain what I mean by actual stage destruction in my opinion. So what I mean when I say stage destruction, when the characters do they, their ultimate jutsu, I want it to be able to affect the environment such as the surface or the air depending on what the nature of the jutsus that they have. An example of I, when I mean the surface and I want the surface to change, when Sasuke does his meteorite jutsu where he drops a meteorite from the sky such as Madara Uchiha's jutsu that is very similar, I would like for an, indent, an indentation to be present within the surface of the floor. And also when other characters do jutsu such as fireball jutsus i would like for it to scorch at least a certain part of the surface or evaporate water if the player is fighting within a map that has frequent amounts of bodies of water and i know cc2 can pull this off because they have already been implementing new things as like i said with elemental changes such as if your character is attacked by a fire style jutsu they can extinguish the flames by moving around or moving to a body of water as one would think and it, a little bit of that was shown in a Naruto gameplay from when Sasuke was scorched by Fireball Jutsu, I believe, if it was him or not. But anyways, um, CC2 had, has promised that we will re be receiving stage destruction. So I just hope that they do it in a professional manner um, because some companies, when they're making the games, they will add stage destruction, but they won't properly optimize it or do it the way that it should be done. Hence, Dragon Ball Xenoverse. The stage destruction was done, but it wasn't done professionally as it was only in certain stages and it irritated certain people, such as when you would do a Kamehameha wave at the ground, the particles would regenerate. And that's a problem that I don't want to happen in Storm 4. I don't want the ground to change, but then regenerate because that would be very annoying and it would simply negate the fact of stage destruction itself all in the matter. Now, I wonder what you guys think about this and um, I hope you guys are agreeing with me on this and a few more further examples for anyone who didn't understand what stage destruction is. Um, I don't know if you guys remember, but in Naruto Storm 3, when you were fighting Madara Uchiha, he did the wood style deep wood emergence jutsu, which is pretty much where he creates a huge forest. And he had set the forest on fire with his fire style annihilation jutsu. So that was also stage destruction because he changed the environment with his attacks. So I would also like if... If you're fighting on a map, I don't know if I've already said this, but if you're fighting on a map with a huge body of water and someone does a fire style jutsu, I would like if the water would evaporate and sort of make a mist like effect and the water would pretty much diminish from the floor. That would be really great and that would be in my opinion complete stage destruction. Now I do understand guys that this will be kind of difficult for CC2 to do for every single map and that it might be done in a poorly way in some aspects. but. I just want the stage destruction to be complete. If it's been if it's been promised to us, I believe that it should be done professionally, and that was why I want to state my opinion over this because I know the game has has not been released yet, and they're still working on it. It's just that I we have yet to see stage destruction. It was just a major concern for me, um, because I know that they have been doing all the other things that a lot of us have been asking for, such as the counterattack system, which was a major burden to many people coming from Storm Generations and Storm Three. But anyways, guys, this is. For I hope you guys enjoyed this video on stage destruction in Storm 4. How should it be done in my concerns? Uh, this has been Frostfang and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.